Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. Chances are you've seen a few of my fun videos on the web, and one of them I'm actually interacting with a telemarketer. I can't stand telemarketers, and when they call me up, I put them on speakerphone, and when I'm streaming live, which is pretty much 24 hours a day, seven days a week, at least when I'm at, in front of the computer, uh, everyone's having fun with a telemarketing call that otherwise would be annoying. So someone asked a question, and I don't think he had actually seen one of those fun videos. Well, I thought they were fun. Phil Navetsnik, sorry for slaughtering your last name if I did. I've been going around asking this, but no one has, seems to know for sure. Would you know how to possibly record phone calls from the landline phone to the PC, like for interviews, etc.? Is it possible? Someone said VoIP, but I can't afford it at the moment. Uh, well, first of all, let me kind of debunk a myth there. VoIP doesn't necessarily cost money. VoIP is just another technology. Voice over IP, and of course we've done a video question and answer on what VoIP is if you want to know more. It's just a technology. It's not necessarily a, a cost associated with a technology. So if you're looking to record interviews over the phone, the easiest thing that you can do, well, is to buy one of these. It costs about 20 bucks at Radio Shack, literally. It's a Radio Shack brand. It's a recording control device, also known as a multi-phone recording controller, and it's quite simple. Uh, this acts as a go-between uh, between a phone or a phone line and your computer. So essentially you plug one end, end into the phone, the other jack into this, and then you plug this little adapter into the audio and that little adapter into the other audio jack, and pretty soon you know it, uh, you can use this device to record. It acts as kind of a, a receiver for anything that's coming in over that particular landline, over that phone line. This I've used to a certain degree of success in the past. The issue I've had with this is that there's no leveling control. So you have to get the volume just right. And if someone speaks too loudly, it'll make everything sound just absolutely ghastly. So to that end, I would actually point you to using a voice over IP or a VoIP service. There's Gizmo, which we've also mentioned before on this particular, uh, I guess, video tutorial series thing, whatever the hell you want to call it. Um, or if you want, you could use Skype in conjunction with a, a, a piece of software called Pamela, which seems to be the best way to record Skype calls. Um, it, 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 it's going to cost you money no matter how you look at it. It's either going to cost you money in terms of buying hardware or actually using software. If you're talking about recording interviews, I'm, I'm telling you, don't even mess with this. Go software all the way. You'll be able to figure it out using either the solutions that I recommended or any of the solutions that anybody in the chat room may recommend or may have recommended during uh, this particular recording. If, if you have a solution, if you're watching this particular video that didn't get mentioned in chat or somewhere in the comment thread, by all means, suggest it. I'm always open to learning new ways of doing things, especially if they're easier. Um, you know, the world of technology is just beginning to open up for people and, uh, you know, the, you're recording phone messages or recording interviews over the phone is just one way that uh, we're starting to use it, uh, or I guess people have been using it for years. The important thing you got to keep in mind, um, and I've probably been uh, not so careful with this when it comes to telemarketers, but they're invading my privacy, uh, you have to make sure you're telling the other person that you're recording the call. It's very important for legal reasons. It's very, very important. So. That's, that's a, a little caveat that we'll I'll throw in there just so you're, you're covered legally.